Hi guys! To all my subbies out there, I have a really great haul. Um, this is from Hoot Look and um, I love Hoot Look. If you're not familiar with Hoot Look, um, they're part of Nordstrom's and Nordstrom's Rack and um, the website, um, so obviously there's like Nordstrom's has their own website and then Nordstrom, Nordstrom Rack is like a discount site, but Hoot Look is part of it and it's their flash sale site. And I got turned on to it like a year ago and um, they do things like um, they have beauty stuff, they have women's clothing, men's clothing shoes, jewelry, purses, all sorts of fantastic things. Um, but I have been really, really loving whenever they do their flash sales of some beauty things. So we'll get right into it. Um, the Balm, which is a company that I like um, usually about once every three months, has a flash sale on there. So I'm going to review the stuff that I was able to get and I'm super super happy about what I got. I splurged a little bit because I had a little bit of extra money and I got some things that I have been wanting to get from the Balm because I had, um, I think you guys have seen me review the Balm Meets Matte palette that I love and of course my Mary Luminizer that I love. Um, I just love everything that I tried from the Balm. There hasn't been one bad thing. I think their eyeshadows are amazing. I just love them. Now, the one thing I will say about Hoat Look is their packing leaves something to be desired. Whenever I've gotten things, it's usually just like stuff thrown in a box and then a piece of this. I'm really, really surprised that I've had no problems with things breaking. But, of course, they give you your nice invoice and we'll start going through what I got. I will start out with um, the lip products that I got. Um, the first thing I got was the Bomb Girls lipstick, um, and this is, their packaging is, like, adorable. It really wins me over, but the thing is that it's not just about packaging with this company. The Bomb, their quality is also the Bomb. They are the bomb.com. I'm just saying, and that is their website. It's the bomb.com. <laughs> so, okay, the Bomb Girls. Lipstick, and the name of this is My Bills Be Paid. Or Maya Bills Be Paid. <laughs> I just love them. I really do. So this is a nude shade. So I am sewing, I'm, oh my god, it's so cute. So it just says, like, starring in this film are Maya Bills Be Paid and James Balm. <laughs> That is so good. And then the color itself is called Maya Bills Be Paid. But they look like little bullets. It's really nice packaging, um, I think, for a lipstick. And a lot of people will say things about smells. And the smell of this is like vanilla. So I will be going back and buying more Balm lipstick. And it's just yummy -rific. So that was the one lipstick that I got. I also got a lip gloss and their lip glosses are called Read My Lips. The color I got was BAM. So um, I'm quite excited about it. So you can see this is what the packaging looks like and it is sort of like a My Lips But Butter you know, color. Um, and again it's a lip gloss. Now I smelled this and it does have a nice smell. It's like a citrusy scent. So nothing unpleasant about it. So those are the two lip products I got. And I definitely will be getting some more lip products. Definitely. I will probably, the next time Hot Look has um, the balm on, I will probably be buying the rest of the lipsticks. Because they're normally $22. And the balm is at like a high-end um, price point. But these flash sales that I'm talking about, they put all of their products at at least 50% below with their normal level. So um, I believe it was the lipsticks were $8.50 on the site which is the price that you would pay for like a Revlon lipstick at Rite Aid or what have you. And then these were $7.50 the lip glosses. Um, the blushes they are very well known for their blushes and I got three of them. Um, they retail for about $25 each um, online and I got Frat Boy which 
um, is a nice, I'm going to do like reviews of their blushes, I think. So I think for right now, I'm just going to show you what I got. So I got Frat Boy, um, which is in the pink family. I got Down Boy. I mean, come on, how freaking cute is their packaging? <laughs> and all of their products, and this is true about you know, lots of makeup companies, but they actually tell you it. All of their products can be used as like a shadow or as a blush or, I mean, you could use a powder product on your lips for a highlight, for example. Sometimes I put the Mary Luminizer on my lips to make them pop. Um, and then I also got one from their In Stain line. I got Argyle. So I'm super excited about using these and um, their packaging is just adorable. I will show you one of the blushes, but I'm gonna I'm gonna do like a in-depth product review of these. But this is what the packaging looks like. So this is Frat Boy, and it's like a football field, and then it's like a pinkish shade. But it has a mirror, and it's magnetic, and they all all of their packaging has like a cover like this. It's like a sort of like a matchbox. So all really really cute. So then I also got three palettes and I think you guys remember I'm gonna grab it from back here this is something that I already have this is the meat matte nude palette so I have been wanting to get the original meat matte palette so this is meat matte nude and this is meat matte um, obviously a big huge size difference um, this on Hot Looks site I believe I paid like $22 for and I have a review of that that I'll link below and then this is the Meat Matte Palette. Um, so this was the original one, and it is just as adorable. All of the shats or shadows are named after different gentlemen that are named Matt. And, you know, it gives a little description of Matt. And, of course, you know, they're just really, really nice colors. So these are the shadows. It does have a mirror. They are all matte shadows, and I will do a more in-depth um, review of this palette at some point and some looks. But yeah, I got the Meat Matte um, palette, the regular one. This is no longer available on the bomb.com. Um, it is an older palette, so when I saw it come up on Hope Looks website, I was really happy about that because I have been trying to buy it. And every time I had seen it on like eBay or something, I wasn't sure if they were used or what have you. So I thought this was, when I saw it come up, and I believe I paid $15 for this, and it was originally like 40 so I was happy about that. I also got the Bombs Bomb Jovi palette. So this is so cute. Um, so it says on it, living on a stair instead of living on a prayer. Um, it's the Rockstar Face Palette. So this is more than just a eye palette, it's a face palette. So you can see back here that they go into great detail in showing you what the colors are. These are all the shadows and then these um, are lip and cheek and a highlighter even is involved in this palette. So I'm going to take it out of its packaging just like the blushes. It They all have over covers that are identical to what's on the inside. See. And the way that these are made are just so nice. So you open it up and in here you have all of your powder products. Oops. So, and you have a nice mirror, um, which I'll kind of put back here. And so you have all of your powder products and you have a highlighter um, and a blush. And um, the powder products have really cute names. Like one of them, like this row here, are the heavy metals, and they're named after like Metallica, Iron Maiden. I got two tickets to Iron Maiden, baby. Blah blah blah. I can't sing. I know. Alice um, Copper is one of them. That's so cute like Alice Cooper. And then they have like the classics are in the middle and they're all matte shades. Um, Adigo, Allegro, Moderato, Presto. So I believe those are all like operatic terms or opera terms. And then um, over here is the alternative shades and they're Blink 1982, The Stroke, R.E.M. and Third Eye Blinded. So super, super cute. And then one of the things, and then down here there is a highlighter that is very similar to Mary Luminizer, but more 
well, actually, it might be Mary Luminizer, but they're calling it Disco Disco Solid Gold Luminizer. So, and then over here, this is a, a blush, and it's called Pop Pop Don't You Want Me. So, that's really cute. And then you can close that, and then down here, you have your cream products, and there are two cream products that can be used as lip products or as cheek stains. Um, and they are called the Lips, Lip Sync Playback Millie and Vanilli. And if you do not know who Millie and Vanilli is, you need to Google that shiznat. <laughs> Google that shiznat. But they're really, so it's like, one is like a neutral, then one is like a dark red. So they're really pretty. I think they'll make good blushes or good lip products. I have a feeling that I'm going to end up using them as blushes because I really wanted to try that this winter. Um, I've seen a lot of YouTubers that use like a liquid blush and then put a powder over top of it for lasting power. So then my very last thing that I got, I'm sorry, this is a lot of stuff I know, so I'm trying not to go into too much detail on each of them. I also got the Bon Voyage palette, which was their holiday palette from last year. And I'll take it out, out of its packaging, and on here it says, um, it shows Manila, America, Italy, Istanbul. Um, and again, it opens the same way. So you have up here, and then this mirror thing is like a passport, which is super cute. And then um, you have the colors, and they are beautiful, right? But they are named after, like, plane seats, so like A4, A1. And the thing that I found really cute about this, because normally in palettes and eyeshadow palettes, They'll have the lighter colors and then go to the dark colors. But if you think about it, this is like a plane, and so they start out with the lighter colors, and then in the back row are the darker colors because these are like row A, um, um, and then B, C, D. So 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 totally cute, totally cute. I love it. And then same as the other palette, they have their liquid products down here, and they are calling these um, lip or cheek. And they're named after who would be in the cockpit, which is the second officer, the first officer, and of course, the captain. So it's like a plane. So, so neat. So neat. So there's a total of 16 eyeshadows in here, three lip and cheek stains, and three lip and cheek stains. So this was their last year holiday palette. And again, each of these palettes I paid about $20 for, and they're normally like $45 to $49. You know, the normal price of a higher end palette. Um, so I really love the bomb. Like I can't talk enough about them. I think they're fantastic. If the bomb is listening to me out there, sorry, I didn't mean to get cute. If the bomb.com is out there listening to me, um, I would love to review some of your products. I noticed that they are coming out with a new dude palette that I have my eyes on. It seems to only be available on the Kohl's website, but I would love to get my hands on it. And I would definitely love to try a lot of their lippy products. So, they're awesome! Thebomb.com! Remember, Hot Look. And down below, you're going to have uh, a link to Hot Look. And if you want to link on my referral code um, and then share that with other people or what have you. But I think you get something off whenever you first sign up, like a percentage or something, or maybe like $10 um, if you sign up like through that link. So, go for it. Okay, that's it for my Hot Look um, haul. <laughs> Love you guys. Bye.